this is an accelerometer this is a sensor which is used to find acceleration of a, any object in x y and z axis this can be used to find the tilt of a, any object by using the component of acceleration due to gravity acting on each axis in this project we will be using the component of acceleration in x and y axis to find the roll and pitch of an aircraft we know that an aircraft has got three axes front front to rear axis is called fore and aft axis and wing tip to wing tip is called the lateral axis and the uh, this is the vertical axis tilting of an aircraft in the fore and aft axis or the pitch axis is called pitch angle so this is the pitching movement and uh, tilting in the lateral axis uh, this is called the roll movement this pitch and roll movements are very important to be monitored and controlled in any flying uh, aircraft or a drone so in uh, our project we will be uh, measuring and displaying the pitch uh, the pitch as well as the roll movement using the uh, accelerometer adxl335 so this adxl335 is a low power accelerometer um, having the measuring range of plus minus 3g this is the interconnection uh, circuit for the pitch and roll indicator we are using adxl335 three axis accelerometer to detect pitch and roll pitch and roll is uh, uh, computed from the x and y components of the acceleration due to gravity it is uh, fed to the arduino uno board arduino uno board will be uh, uh, computing this acceleration and it will be converted as uh, pitch and roll angles it will be communicated to the lcd module through the data pins uh, 2 3 4 and 5 and for controlling the lcd module we are having um, the control uh, signals going through 11 and 12 pins and uh, you can see that the brightness of the lcd module is controlled with a 10k port connected to the uh, pin number 3 of uh, lcd module and the lcd module backlight is uh, provided by giving a 5 volt supply to pin number 15 of the module the components uh, required for this uh, project are uh, one is uh, this adxl335 3 axis uh, accelerometer then uh, we, uh, uh, should have a LCD uh, monitor uh, for 16 into 2 lines uh, for displaying the data. Then uh, an Arduino you know, microcontroller board for uh, data acquisition as well as uh, controlling the display. And of course you need a 9 volt battery uh, to power this uh, system uh, to work independently. And a breadboard and a few jumper wires uh, to interconnect uh, all these components. And of course, you will need a PC or a laptop uh, with a free Arduino IDE for program development and a debugging. Now we will go to the um, uh, hardware and software details uh, of this project. If you like this project, uh, kindly subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done. And also uh, give a thumbs up to encourage me to take uh, fresh new videos. Now the source code for our project is ready. The first line is hash and include liquid crystal dot touch. This is the header file to be included for using the pre-compiled library functions in the uh, Arduino for uh, liquid crystal display. The first line after this uh, 
ഈ എസ് എ ലിക്വിഡ് ക്രിസ്റ്റൽ എൽ സി ഡി ട്വൽവ് ഇലവൻ ഫൈവ് ഫോർ ത്രീ ടു ഈസ് ടു കോൺഫിഗർ പിൻ നമ്പർ ട്വൽവ് ആൻഡ് ലെവൻ ആസ് കമാൻഡ് ലൈൻസ് ആൻഡ് ഫൈവ് ഫോർ ത്രീ ആൻഡ് ടു ആസ് ഡാറ്റ ലൈൻസ് നോ ദീസ് ഡെക്ലറേഷൻസ് ആർ ഫോർ കോൺഫിഗറിംഗ് ദി എ ഡി സി ചാനൽസ് എ സീറോ ആൻഡ് എ വൺ വിത്ത് എക്സ് ആക്സലറേഷൻ ഇൻപുട്ട് ആൻഡ് വൈ ആക്സലറേഷൻ ഇൻപുട്ട്സ് റെസ്പെക്റ്റീവ്ലി ഹിയർ വി ആർ ഇനിഷ്യലൈസിങ് ദി വാല്യൂസ് ഓഫ് എക്സ് ആക്സലറേഷൻ ആൻഡ് വൈ ആക്സലറേഷൻ ഇൻപുട്ട്സ് ടു സീറോ ഹിയർ ദി എക്സ് ആക്സലറേഷൻ ബയസ് ആൻഡ് വൈ ആക്സലറേഷൻ ബയസ് is determined and put in this one so that we can uh, correct the uh, reading using these bias values these two variables are declared for uh, holding the corrected values of uh, acceleration and this will be uh, displayed as the pitch and roll angles this uh, setup function is to configure the serial monitor of the laptop at uh, 9600 bps to monitor uh, the data for debugging purpose now this is the main loop where we are doing all the data acquisition and the display on the lcd these uh, lines are for configuring the 16 to 2 lcd and uh, writing various labels like a pitch roll degrees etc at the appropriate locations x is equal to analog read x pin so this will be reading the analog value of acceleration to the x acceleration x esc variable here we are applying the bias values to the acceleration to get the unbiased pitch angles these two lines are for uh, the monitoring of these values uh, during debugging in the laptop here we are uh, taking the cursor of uh, lcd to uh, the um, sixth position in the first uh, the top line of the lcd and uh, writing the corrected acceleration or the uh, pitch angle to this location here we are reading uh, the y acceleration values well then we are correcting uh, the y acceleration by using the bias value to find the roll angle these two lines are for uh, uh, monitor in the debugger here we are taking the cursor to the second line sixth position to write the value of y acceleration corrected value or the roll angle now this is uh, for going to next line in the debugger now we are delaying uh, for 100 milliseconds to get the steady lcd display this is a closing bracket after completing the delay it will be going to the beginning of the loop again uh, writing the labels acquiring the values correcting and uh, writing it to the lcd etc so this uh, loop will be continuing till we switch off the uh, module
now once uh, this is over we can uh, check whether our uh, source code is correct by compiling it by clicking verify compile now it has compiled correctly and you have seen the message has come that it has uh, compiled correctly once this after compiling we have to connect the Arduino uh, with the wired completely wired board to the PC through the USB cable this uh, white cable and now we can upload the software to the Arduino upload now uploading is taking place you can see the Arduino yellow LED is blinking yeah, now the unit has started measuring the pitch and the roll angles you can see okay. See the roll. Now the pitch 